Hi everybody. Welcome to those who've been hanging with me some time and welcome those of you who are new to my channel. I'm Adele Levine, intuitive and medium. So yeah, we're doing a little something different. I'm a professional medium for those who are new to me for about 18 years and they, I play video games. Not a gamer, not a pro. Give me a break. Um, I played this game for a little bit, so I'm just going to let you know. Um, so I kind of know a little bit how it works. So before I showed you me playing it, but I'm going to give you my commentary as a medium, maybe as someone who plays video games, but not that I'm an expert or anything. And um, we're going to give it a whirl. So ready? Here we go. Let's go to new game. And let's see. I'm wearing, you'll see why I'm wearing a leather jacket. It's really corny, really corny. Why? I'm really out of my element. Okay. It's butterflies. It's good. It's kind of a medium spiritual thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Let's go. It all starts. Dead with girl. A dead girl. Mm hmm. Oh, wow, this looks familiar. Okay, she's running. Is she dead? Oh, it looks like this guy's gonna kill her. It's about how my life is. All right. Well, here's the thing. It's really important. All spiritual people drink tea. I don't. I drink coffee. Ever since so, I was little. I've had this. Here we go. Dream. Yeah. It's the end of summer. A girl is running through the woods. Ever since I was a little girl, I had dreams, but the different. Boom, the scent of pines. And then. Say she has a leather jacket on. The gunshot. Because mediums wear leather jackets. Actually, they do, but hers is cooler. And I did used to have those cups, by the way, so a little suspicious. It always felt so real. The blood on my cheek, the cold sweat running down my skin. I'd managed to convince myself it really happened. This scar of a memory. But part of me I could never fully understand. I used to smoke. That's a Maybe a medium thing. Allison Dubois, if you know who she is. No wonder people used to think I was strange. She's the show Mediums based off of if FY. They only knew. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. It starts. That day when the phone rang. It's really pretty. It was the hardest day of my life. The day I went home to say goodbye to my father. Mm -hmm. To dress him up for My father dream. passed. Interesting. Put him in a suit, fix his tie. Simple. Just the things he did every day. But looking through his stuff wasn't easy. Oh. I needed a moment myself together. Yep. Have a cigarette for me. I was almost ready. I just had to find his special tie clip. Okay. So the one thing about this game, if you're wondering why I'm not looking up close to things because uh, this is the camera. 
Well, there's the calendar. I didn't read it last time, so I guess, oh, looks like he, you know, got sick, this guy. Um, as you can see, it's far away. This is how it works. Maybe she's supposed to use her medium skills. Shit. I don't know. Yeah. Nice it's really kind of makes it difficult. Jack's room. So I'm going to take you. It's like he never... What are you saying damn it for? Okay, so it's like awards he got. Jack was part of the Solidarity Movement. He spent a few months yeah. in an internment camp, but even that couldn't dampen his spirit. So there we go. And then you go over to... Wait, and did I look at the... Jack was a humble, religious man. He ran a funeral home. And it's convenient. Funeral home. It felt good to be useful. A medium who lives. Keep hissing at me. Above or below a funeral out. home? I'm not sure. So. I used to think I'd never fit in, but Jack. He didn't mind my weirdness. He kept telling me I was special. I mean, it's kind of true. Here we go. Boom. Camera change. Boom. Camera change. I used to have a thing for them. Don't know why, really. I guess they just used to make me happy. Well, then why are they dead? Jack knew it well. That's why there's so many of them here. But then, like, why does she have dead ones? I mean, butterflies are supposed to represent the cycle of life and all that, but hers are dead. This isn't... Kids from the orphanage. Not all of them had my luck. That's why I kept coming back. To play. To take care of them. To listen. That was the least I could do. So weird thing, both my parents passed, and I used to work with children. So I relate to that. Not that everything about this game has to be what I relate to. Oh, I didn't see that this mirror before. Okay, cool. I can't believe it's all still here. Oh, so I'm kind of going dead. through this quick because I already know how this whole thing works because I did it already. You get this paper. Oh, I guess I forgot about this one. And you put it here. I can do it now. Wait, put it, put it here. Why isn't? It? Oh, I have to turn the light on. I forgot. Turn the light on. Then. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Where's the paper? Wait. Oh, wait. So you go, why isn't she, oops, sorry, I'm used to my PlayStation. You take the paper, I already have the paper. Baby, oh, nobody's here. <laughs> Cut that out. <laughs> All right, um, I forgot how you get the paper, by the way. I know that you're supposed to take the paper here and you're supposed to sorry guys I told you so <laughs> what am I doing again oh sorry put the paper there turn the light on one two Three, light off. Pick the paper up. Ah, oh, that's too thick. <sighs> it needs longer oh God. exposure. Listen, use your medium skills. One, two, three. Okay, then you take. Oh, I missed my window. Oh, come on. Turn the light on. Turn, put the paper. 
Nope. With the paper, where's the, where is it? Do I have to get it again? Oh my God, I suck, I suck so bad. Okay, put the paper down first, then turn the light on. One, two, three, go. How is it too quick? I counted to the clock. One, two, three, four, Okay. I missed my window. Now it's overexposed. All right, I know what I did wrong. So I have to first get the paper. <sighs> Put the paper here. What does this have to do with mediumship? Okay. <laughs> it's the spirits. One, two, three. There you go. Okay. So then you go and you put it in this one for five seconds. Ah, oh, that's too quick. It needs longer exposure. What? Oh, oh that's God. Too quick. One, it needs two, three. Okay. And then you put this in here. Oh, the paper's not in there. Okay. There we go. And then you go in here. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, cool. Then you go in here. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we're getting something. Looks a little ghosty. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. I wasn't a, I'm not a photographer, I'm a medium. Okay. But she's a photographer. She's thinking about it. Look at all my creepy photographs. Now let's go back and let's go to the door and it begins. Yeah, right. Oh my Tie. God, the tie clip. Pull, Pull it together, together Mary, Mary and get the tie clip. Okay. Pretty sure she goes, is it in this room? She goes in his room and gets his tie clip. This isn't it. So don't do this. It's hard to see because look at the angle. It's like, come on. I did this, by the way, just so you know, if you're going to play this game, there's nothing over here. I did all that. And here we go. I think you go this way. I remember it was something weird. So it's not in here. It's in the bathroom. Oh no, you just look at this thing. And you go out the bathroom. It's a little hard to tell. It took me a while to find his room. I'm pretty sure I had to go like this way. No. You see, like, look at the angles. Like, how is someone supposed to know where they're going? I get lost in real life. I'm, oh my God, this is so frustrating. I can't remember where his room is. <laughs> okay, it's not there. Here's this living room area, right? That's, or not, <laughs> that's not the living room, it's the kitchen. But you see these angles? Anybody let me know. Am I crazy to say these angles are bizarre? Like, how am I supposed to know where I'm going here? Is it this room? I know, I'm going to get mad. Because now, I don't, nope. This is not where the tie clip is. Uh, it's, it's not in this is her room so 
You know, sometimes music lets you know, but not, no, no, not this game. Is there something over here? Oh my god, it's so frustrating. This happened to me. I can't believe I played this before and it's still happening to me. All right, I did miss the tie clip, just so you know. Um, Come on, Jack, where'd you put it? Uh-oh, okay. she's getting, this is important. Let's she this uses her way. psychic powers. There it is. I see it through the clock. Well, if I had that power, I would have found this tie clip a lot sooner. <laughs> I mean, there's remote viewing and then there's seeing through things. Okay. Yeah, there is, that is it. Jack's waiting downstairs. Time to say goodbye. Well, you're a little bit into the dead body thing. It's a little different. Mediums deal with spirits. You're dealing with both. Just not the same. Wait, no, not that way. All right, here we go. All right, let's go say hi to Jack. Body. And these doors mean nothing. It's just funeral homes in the backyard. Jack taught me to accept my condition. I could. Of all my foster condition. parents, he was the only one who saw it as a gift and not Both. a curse. Both a gift and a curse. I wouldn't call it a condition, though. Okay. This is what it says. Last goodbye, funeral home. Wow, that's specific. <laughs> To the point. Okay. Here we go. Going in. Ooh. Jack's in the prep room. Ooh. Prep room. Sounds official. Oh, weird. I don't remember locking. Oh. It. The key should be in the office. Okay, let's go in the office. Here we go. Key is somewhere here. She's got to go all the way around because, you know, that makes sense. Not sure if I'm ready for this. She's like, I ah, know bombing rooms, no big deal. Here we go. Hey, Jack. My cat just pulled the... Okay. Oops. Let go. Why isn't she letting go? Oh, sorry. Come over here, get the tie. By the way. Oh, we have to look at him first. I got your special clip. No. Where's your tie? Yeah, right. Oh, well, look at that. Sorry about that, guys. Just thought that was fun. It's right here. So you do... Put it, put it on. Snazzy. You wouldn't have it any other way. A tie clip and a tie. Okay. Let's put his tie on him. Mission accomplished. I didn't expect this to be easy. I guess I didn't know what to expect. When things get personal, it, it just burns you from the inside out. you're ready she could just talk to him right here just saying as a medium you just talk to spirit right now but I don't think that's the way she works just fine
just done. Oh, can't you people read? The signs that's closed. Mm. Well, I don't think it's people. I don't know. Lights flickering, that's a thing for sure. You guys got that good. Let's go. Butterfly. Guess that tells her someone died. Where are you going? Oh, there's a spirit right there. Going up dark uh, stairwells. Here we go. Door just closed on its own. Yeah, it seems about right. Crash. Nobody's pissed off. What the hell? Why are you surprised? You're a medium. You know that it's a spirit. I guess you I mean. It too. And then it happened. As it did so many And this times. is where it gets interesting. Just when I thought my day couldn't get any worse. She split in two. Oh, where is that darn notebook? I'm gonna be late. I need to find that. Marianne? I could figure out what's going on with this face. You guys tell me. Like, is it a mask or is just he's dead? So one side of her is this material world, one side's the spirit world. See? Now, you didn't happen to see my notebook, did you, darling? Uh, my memory's a bit fuzzy. So much for aging gracefully. Eh? Where is that? Miss me, Jack. You should probably get some rest. Forget the Just note. tell him he's died. Oh, oh no. I've got so much work, my dear. It's I, okay, I, know, I, I can't just... I mean, this part's true. You do feel like you're talking with people that no one sees. Sort of. Kind of. What's wrong with you? Not literally talking to a chair, though. Why is it so cold in here? <laughs> Where is that shh, 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 shh. Hmm? It's okay, Jack. Yeah. It's okay. Not literally talking to a chair. I like she has white hair because that's it's always fine. been it's white so streaks nice. always been my thing. No, uh, I, I, I'm worried about the surgery. When I'm at the hospital, are, are you sure? I think the surgery didn't right? go so well, Jack. Yes. Should tell him the truth. It's gonna be fine. Nah, it's not fine. Uh, oh, you, you know, uh, I promised myself. I would never let anything happen to you. Not while I'm around. Aww. I'll be fine. I promise. Uh, <laughs> no risky stuff then. Huh? Alright? Alright, Jack. Now, get some uh, rest. I need no. Yes, yes. Sorry. Maybe be good, Mary Ann. I love you, my child. I've loved you since the moment you walked into my life. Remember that. It's a thing that people always do. They have the light person start to disintegrate with light. And not a thing. But cool looking. Most people would give anything to have that yeah. opportunity. To say all the things that were left mm -hmm. unsaid. But it didn't make things any easier. No, that's true. I could help a thousand souls cross over, but when it came to Jack, it still hurt like hell. I love you too, Daddy.
I used to think everyone saw the world the way I did. I kind of see it the way. Divided. Torn between two realities. She needs a drink now. She's kind of accurate. But, no. I was the only one. Phone call. Or so uh -oh. I thought. We're closed. There's another funeral home across town. I can give you the number. At... Mary Ann. Who is this? You don't know mm. me, Mary Ann. But I know you. Look, if this is a joke, I... You need to listen to me, Mary Ann. Okay, I'm hanging up. I know what you are. What? Who is this? My name is Thomas. I need your help. Uh, listen, if that's all you've got, I'm... No, uh, there's more. I can give you the answers you've been looking for your whole life. Careful. I need Could be a guru. You. I don't even know you. It all starts with a dead girl. Whoa. What did you say? The Nemo Resort. Find me there. Please. The light, it's almost gone. It's not dark yet, but it's getting there. You're the only one who can stop it. You're my only chance. You're my only hope. Hello? Hello? Shit. Alright. So, that's... Pretty much how it goes. Um, she splits and sees between two realities. Um, do I really, what I think about the game, I think that's cool. You have to like show how people see things because obviously it's not fun to just see someone sitting there. No, for me, I'm not like hugging people who you can't see. Am I talking to people and seeing people in a different way other people are? Sure. But it's telepathic. But that's like implying she's like hugging the person that's there. Um, but that's what you have to do when you're doing visual stuff. If you're doing a movie or a game or something, it has to look cool. And it does look cool. And I love the white hair because I've always had this thing about me having like a white streak or white hair. It does symbolic in a lot of movies, like the sixth sense of kind of like between, you know, kind of like a spiritual thing or whatever. Um Freddy Krueger, stuff like that. So I do get that they're trying to show the dual thing. It's really cool. I love the whole concept of everything, but the whole moving around and not being able to see where you're going is really hard to do just as a, just playing a game. Not that I'm a gamer or anything, but just someone who plays games. It was kind of frustrating for me. Um, like if they had given her like a sixth sense where that's, she gets closer to things or something. I don't know, but I think the idea, it's kind of interesting. Her dad died, you know, both my parents died, but one of the people I was closer with my dad. Um, but I was raised by some other people somewhere, which is interesting because my parents died when I was very young and I was raised by my aunt and uncle and then he, you know, she died and then he died. So yeah, kind of interesting things. There always is kind of this backstory of these crazy gifts slash curse. So that's it, guys. Check it out if you want to play it. I just thought it'd be fun. It's rare that, you know, I'm a medium and there's a game called The Medium. There's a lot of games like this, obviously, but I just thought it would be fun. And um, <laughs> thanks for, like, coming along with me while I did this. Um, I know it's a little different than my rest of my videos. Check out my video before where I announced my Patreon and things like that for all you guys who kind of are familiar with me and know me. Um, I started that and uh, I'm really excited about that. So I'm still going to say, follow yourself, follow no one, listen to your inner voice or to Jack's. And I'll see you soon.